Hey everybody, we are back in Gigi's kitchen and I'm going to make up some quick um, chicken and rice. So I'm gonna let y'all watch while I do that. I boiled, uh, not boiled, I put in the crock pot my chicken I got from the food pantry, the whole chicken. I cooked it all night in my crock pot and I boned it and I have some uh, leftover rice, and it's not your ordinary the way you do chicken and rice, but it's what I'm gonna mix up for me and my sister. We'll eat it and it'll be just fine. So I was just gonna let y'all watch while we uh, did that. Hopefully everybody had a good Valentine's Day. Uh, the sun's been out quite a bit here today, but uh, it's kind of it's kind of warm, y'all. Uh, it's probably up in the 70s in my house. I don't have the air conditioner on. I don't want to turn it on. The light bill's too high. But I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it. We all going to make it, right? But I'm going to let y'all watch my little pan here. So y'all can see what I do. Y'all know. The ones of y'all that's visited, y'all know. Y'all know how I am. Y'all know how I am. <clears throat> so, uh... I'm going to spray my pan with a little non-stick spray. Um, and I'm going to take one can of cream, cream of mushroom soup. Y'all, I, th I think I need a nap. I think I've run out of energy. Y'all ever feel like that? Is that because I'm a, is that because I'm an old person? I don't remember used to feeling like that this time of day. So y'all, uh, leave me some comments and uh, tell me tell me good stuff that's going on in your life. I know the Lord's blessing y'all. I know He's blessing y'all. We're gonna get some. Uh, we're gonna get some sour cream. Y'all remember when I made them chicken enchiladas? I used that sour cream. Well, that's my sour cream that I had left, y'all. Uh, we don't waste nothing around here. I tell y'all that all the time. None of this food that comes in this house goes to waste. Somebody eats it or somebody uses it, I can assure you. I can assure you of that. Get this out of the way. We don't want water to get on it. That would be a bad thing. Okay. Let me see. I'm not going to put salt and pepper because this soup is real salty. And the chicken was already seasoned. I am going to get a little bit of um, a little bit of water because that's pretty thick. I'm going to get a can of water and that'll probably, of course it'll, it's going to melt down some, you know, when we get it, when we get it in the oven. I guess the cabinet's hungry. I splashed it all over the cabinet. I guess it, now if that was on the floor, Brinley would be having a big old time, wouldn't she? She could be leaking that up. And she knows I'm saying her name and she is watching what mama is doing. She is watching. Y'all ever had the, the tab on your pool can of soup break off? Well, mine did, y'all. I don't know that I've ever had that happen. And I like to never got in that can of soup. I'm glad I wasn't doing that on the camera because it took forever. That way y'all wouldn't have to be bored with. Y'all wouldn't have to be bored with all that. Brindley, calm down. Y'all, I might need some more water in that. That's pretty thick stuff. That's some pretty thick stuff. 
Y'all, have y'all ever put uh, the dried onion soup mix in your chicken and rice? I found several recipes. I've been looking at Pinterest a lot <clears throat> the last few days. And I never have done that. But y'all, there's a lot of recipes for that. Y'all, it might take two cans of water. Y'all know me. I ain't got no recipe. I'm making this up as I go. I ain't got no recipe, y'all. I used to put my rice in the... I used to just put my chicken in the pan, put my rice in the pan, and my chicken broth, and put it in the oven and let it cook. But I like the flavor that these soups give it. And uh, I'm going to put me some cheese, too. I'm going to put me some cheese on that. Y'all know I love my cheese. Y'all know I love my... Uh, my Kobe Jack cheese and my Mexican cheese. Oh my gosh, we're having an avalanche over here at the freezer. We're having an avalanche. Everything's a falling out. Well, I guess that's good when you got so much food it wants to fall out on you. I'm trying to get my cheese, y'all. I'm trying to get the cheese out. <laughs> okay. Let's, let's get this rice over here. And get it in this. I don't know if I'm going to use all this rice or not, y'all. I don't even know how much. I'm going to guess about four cups of rice. I don't even know how much is in here, in this pan. Probably about four cups. Probably about four cups is what I'm guessing. I'm trying to find my little my little tool that breaks this up. Y'all, I love this little thing. I got this at the Dollar Tree. Y'all can't even see me, can you? Well, my goodness. Now. I'm breaking this up, this rice in this pan. It's, see it in my pan, it's lumpy. Sticky rice. I don't think I'm gonna need all of it. <clears throat> but this is the rice from the food pantry, y'all. The soup's from the food pantry. The sour cream is not. And my cheese, uh, although I do get cheese, but it's not this cheese. Um, but I told my sister I was going to make this and she's home today and she was saying, yum me. She said, I'll be over in a little bit. I said, I bet you will. I bet you will be over in a little bit. She ain't going to turn no food down, y'all. That girl don't like to cook. Okay, there's my there's my bone chicken, and y'all, I'm only going to use part of it. I'm only going to use part of it like I did with that other chicken I showed y'all. I made the soup, and I made the, uh, I made the soup, and what else did I make, y'all? The, the sour cream enchilada. So if y'all hadn't watched those recipes, y'all go watch. Y'all go watch. But this is just, I seasoned. I put two whole onions. I didn't, I peeled them. I didn't chop them up. I just put the onions. Because uh, I didn't want, I'm going to save that broth. And I didn't want the onions in the broth. I just wanted it to have the flavor. But that's about half my chicken. Boned. That's my whole chicken from the food pantry. It's rice from the food pantry. It's soup from the food pantry, one cream of mushroom, one cream of chicken, and uh, about eight ounces of sour cream. Y'all, I've never done this just like this before. I never make nothing the same way. I invent or create or whatever y'all want to call it, but I know one thing. I ain't never seen nobody over here in this kitchen complaining about it. <laughs> I ain't never seen nobody complaining about that it wasn't good. 
I have never seen anybody complain. And I'm just gonna kind of push that around and get that down in that rice. Like I said, this rice is already cooked, y'all. It's already cooked. But that looks like a good, that looks like a pretty good consistency. And y'all, I put water, I could have used some of that chicken broth. I didn't even think about it, but it'll be all right. And have y'all ever cooked your rice in chicken broth instead of water? If y'all like those instant, <clears throat> those little instant packages in the store, you know that's chicken flavor. <coughs> Try cooking your rice in uh, chicken broth instead of just plain water. That's what tastes like, y'all. It's good. It's good. You can dilute. Uh, take your your chicken noodle soup or your chicken and rice soup and add your water and use that mixture use that mixture to uh y'all i'm just working this down in this rice just getting that getting that rice loosened up you know it was sticky and it was thick and i'm just working this down in that rice and now y'all see how quick that was let me look at this time 11 11 minutes and 42 seconds and uh Look at there. We got supper and, and food for tomorrow, me and my sister. That quick. Of course, that chicken, I put it in. That's the whole chicken. I took it out of the bag, put the whole chicken. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. I'm still fighting this little allergy or cough or whatever it is. Y'all, I just tasted that. And it's good, just like that. It's good. It's going to be real good. I'm going to put cheese on it. That mushroom soup and that and that cream of chicken soup gives it a really good flavor. <coughs> it gives it a really good flavor. And y'all, I got rice lift for something else. I'm telling you, I don't waste nothing around here. We're not going to waste food. There's too many people in the world <coughs> that need food. And I see people cook and cook and cook and just throw, throw food out, y'all. And that's so, <coughs> that's so heartbreaking to me. Because I think about all the people and the kids in the world that go to bed hungry at night and how... How we're so privileged and you hear so many people. Y'all, I get upset at the food pantry because people will complain about that food. And I'm sitting there in my mind saying, you know, like, are, are you serious? Like, like these people are giving you this and you're going to gripe about what you got this week? Y'all, and they do. And it's just sad to me. I never complain. I don't care what it is. I don't care what it is. I'm going to make something out of it. <clears throat> but that's the difference in, uh, in people's hearts. Y'all had to wash that cheese off my hand. That's the difference in people's hearts and, uh, and attitudes. You know, it really is. Um. Uh, I am truly thankful. And uh, you know what? <clears throat> this, this mixture would be great stuffed in this. And I may eat this tonight and I may stuff some peppers with this tomorrow and see how that turns out. And if I do, I'll make y'all a video. Because uh, I was wanting to do this with chicken and, uh, and cream cheese. And I was thinking about using that leftover chicken for that. But I might stuff it. I don't know. I might eat all this chicken and rice. I might have to make something else up. I don't, I don't know, y'all. Y'all know how silly I am sometimes. Uh, I just want to thank you again 
I got a lot of new subscribers and uh, I got a new one just shortly a few minutes ago and I want to welcome Beverly. Uh, she's my friend and uh, she subscribed. Uh, I just happened to mention to her that I was doing this and she didn't know. And so welcome her to the family, Miss Beverly. And uh, she's been my friend for a long time, y'all. She's good people. And uh, she was listening to one of my videos and telling me, oh, your voice is so cute. <laughs> it was it sounds different on the video, she said. So I said, yeah, I get a lot about my country voice. So uh, I don't know what y'all think about it, but y'all, it's just, it's just, how the it's just what the how the Lord made me. It's just how I am. It's just how I talk. Like I ain't putting on. This is just how it comes out when I talk. When I talk, y'all. But I'm gonna put that in the oven, and uh, I may take the leftovers tomorrow, or I don't know. I may take the leftover chicken and that rest of that rice and some cream cheese and stuff in those peppers. I'll come up with something. Maybe some beans or corn, some corn in it. That would be good. Uh, I wished I had some roasted corn. I may have some corn on the cob in the freezer that I could put on the grill and roast and cut it off, and that would be good in those peppers. But y'all, I'm gonna come up with something, because I always do. But uh, I'll show y'all my casserole again. That's... Uh, my whole chicken that I got at one of the food pantries. I put it in the crock pot with two whole onions, not chopped. Let me show y'all that. Let me show y'all, because I still have my broth in the container. I've been waiting for it to cool. This is my crock pot and my, there's my, see I got my onion and those are good too. I'll probably eat those. I'll probably eat those on the side with my, but that's my, that's my good broth, y'all. And I'll drink that. I love that. And I'll put some of it in the freezer to uh, use in, uh, to use in other dishes. And uh, here's my, here's my sous chef. Here's the star of the show, Miss Brinley Star. Say hey, Brinley. Say hey, Brinley. Everybody wants to see Brinley. Um, okay, let me get back on track. A whole chicken boiled in the crock pot, in my crock pot right there. Uh, just cover it with water, put your seasonings. Of course, I always put my turmeric. I put two whole onions and it, uh, my pink Himalayan salt and it was seasoned perfectly, y'all. My chicken was perfect. When I boned it, I tasted it, didn't need anything. So I sprayed my pan. I mixed one can of cream of mushroom, one can of cream of chicken, two cans of water. You can use two cans of broth. I should have used the broth, I wasn't thinking, but it's okay. It will make it richer if you use the broth. Uh, two cans of soup, two cans of water. Uh, I had my leftover rice. I probably used about three cups of rice to this pan and put my soup, y'all saw me mix it up. Put my cheese on the top. Simple, simple, easy. We're now into this 19 minutes. And we've got dinner for tonight and food for tomorrow, for sure. And I can turn this into another dish with the peppers if I choose to. If I don't, I may create from the rest of the leftover chicken. The rest of the chicken over here and the rest of the rice. And I may create some kind of stuffing to go in those peppers because I know several people wanted to see me stuff them and y'all I have a lot of ideas uh, for stuffing those peppers and I can't decide which one I want to use <clears throat> but I have several uh, several good recipes that are good for bell peppers jalapeno peppers any kind of peppers that you want that that suits your taste these stuffings are great in these peppers and I love peppers. I'm not really big on green bell pepper, but I like the red or the yellow, the more sweet one. But uh, 
Y'all be blessed. If you try the chicken and rice, let me know. It's really good, y'all. I'm not kidding. That was just room temperature, and it it was perfect to me. I can't imagine when it's hot how good it's going to be. I might make some cornbread or something to go with it. But y'all be blessed. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for sharing. I cannot thank you enough for all that you do for me, for your prayers, saying thank you. Saying thank you just sounds weak. I'm trying to think of the word. Thank you just sounds weak for the way my heart feels for what y'all do for me. Thank you so much. Be blessed. Don't forget to say your prayers and share, 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 share my videos. Don't copy them and share. Don't video them and share. Share them from my Facebook or share them from my YouTube because you're not supposed to copy people's videos. But I love y'all. Thanks for getting the word out. Be blessed. Don't forget to say your prayers.